Introducing DeepSeek's Janus Pro. A big revolution in AI and unified multimodal for understand a picture no matter its equation or anything you can also generate pictures from simple text. Just like Midjourney you can generate multiple images different dimensional. And good thing is you can use it locally on low VRAM even on CPU mood if you follow my instructions. If you are new to my YouTube channel subscribe it and press bell icon to stay updated. Well let's see how you can install this on your computer. Click on GitHub link in my description to go to main page of Janus Pro. To install this you need Python 3.10.11. FFmpeg, if GPU CUDA toolkit, Visual Studio. To install go on main page click on code option and download main zip file. After downloading extract it where you want to install this. After extracting go inside main folder and type cmd in folder path a new command window will open. Create Venv using Python 3.10. Activate Venv with activation code. If you want to install for CPU don't run PyTorch command. For GPU go to main page of PyTorch and copy command for your CUDA version. Paste in command window to install it. After installing PyTorch run requirements code. There are two main model for Janus Pro 1B and 7B. Default is 7B which is about 15 GB model and 1B is 8 GB model. If you are using low VRAM I recommend to use 1B model. Go to main folder and go inside demo folder. Open Pro Janus app PY file in text editor. There you can change model then save the file. Copy main code from main page and paste in command window.
To fix Janus model missing error also copy eGradio code and paste in command window to install. After installing run main code again. Using it first time will download models. After everything done you will see local URL. Copy and paste this in any web browser to launch it. To use it upload a picture. And ask anything about it. Click Run Janus Pro will answer all your questions. You can upload any picture no matter equations to find answers. You can also generate multi-dimensional pictures from your prompt just like mid-journey. To be able to run this again with double click, make a bat file of this. Go to main folder and create new text file. Open text file and type this code you see if you followed my instructions and save as run.bat file. This will create bat file. After closing you can easily run this again. I hope you like this video. If you got any questions or request comment. Don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Take care.